Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. As promised, here is a video on the birthday gala for Prince Christian of Denmark. Prince Christian of Denmark 18th birthday was marked by a gala dinner fit for a future king. Well, after all, he is the second in line to the Danish throne. So royals from all around the world actually traveled to the Danish castle in Copenhagen yesterday, uh, October 15th, for celebrations of the event that was hosted by Christian's grandmother, Queen Margrethe. We were expecting gowns and tiaras, and our expectations were fully satisfied by the royals. Celebrations started in the morning with the prince and the rest of the Danish royal family appearing on the balcony of Amalienborg Castle to wave to the crowds. The prince wore this elegant brown suit, or is it grey? I mean, I can't really tell. To me, it looks more brown. Uh, I don't know what you think about it, but to me it's brown. He was wearing this brown suit with a light pattern and a navy tie, and he looked very comfortable in his role while he was waving to the crowds. Princess Mary stepped out in a bespoke blue Sorin Le Schmidt coat dress, which is a dress that she's already donned in previous occasions, and she finished off the look with the John Vito Rossi pumps. While Queen Margrethe opted for a bolder purple tone, she always loves to use these uh, very strong colored clothes, and she wore earrings and a coordinated brooch set with black pearls and diamonds. Princess Isabella chose gold hoop earrings to complement her ensemble, which also featured a brightly patterned floral blouse with these nice fun flower buttons. Princess Josephine wore a sparkly floral brooch on the lapel of her navy blue jacket. Crown Princess Mary's though jewels were probably the most exciting piece on display. So the brooch she's actually wearing is set with diamonds, pearls and large sapphire. But what's so special about it? Well, it's special because she wore the exact same jewel at baby princess christening in January 2006 when he was born. Let's move on to the actual evening gowns. The guest list for the Grand Gala dinner included some current monarchs and some fellow future monarchs from the Scandinavian royal families. Let's start with Crown Princess Mary. She looked effortlessly elegant as she opted for this gem encrusted blue gown from Danish designer Jesper Hovring and a pair of shimmering diamond drop earrings. She also used the same diamond shara that she wore on her wedding day in 2004. Queen Margrethe commanded attention again in a bright red gown, one of her favorite colors, and she wore the pearl core tiara. She stepped out in the same breathtaking gown by this Danish designer Brigitte Tolo that she used for her Golden Jubilee celebrations in September last year. Princess Isabella of Denmark exuded elegance in a Sophia cobalt blue satin gown incorporating a strapless neckline pleated bodice and full skirt, completed with a flowing scarf. She accessorized with her mother's silver clutch and again her mother's amethyst and diamond drop earrings. Princess Josephine looked equally chic as she arrived at the gala wearing a jasper hovering navy jumpsuit and metallic gold pumps by Anonymous Copenhagen. Princess Elizabeth of Belgium looked every inch the princess in this cream sleeveless gown from Belgian couture brand Natan which she actually teamed with matching tone gloves. Princess Ingrid Alexandra of Norway joined her parents, Crown Prince Hakun and Crown Princess Metamarit. Norway's royal mother-daughter duo looked beautiful in these matching pale blue gowns and sparkling tiaras. Princess Metamarit donned a new Peter Dundas gown, while Princess Ingrid wore a one-shoulder Emilio Pucci gown, which she actually borrowed from her mom and she also borrowed the diamond jewels from her mother. If you like our videos, please remember to like, share and comment. It's not a biggie for you, but it is super important for us. And also subscribe to our channel and hit the bell to make sure that you don't miss our new videos. Princess Estelle of Sweden was also part of the celebration alongside her parents, Crown Princess Victoria and Prince Daniel. The young princess wore a gown by Swedish designer Kistil Lindor, 
complete with the draped tool net, fabric flowers, and pearl embellishments. While Princess Victoria, the heir to the Swedish throne, appeared radiant in a cream Ali Saab gown with a square neckline that showed off her statement diamond necklace. Princess Katharina Mali of the Netherlands, heir to the Dutch throne, joined the event as well. She looked stylish in this cape dress from Essential Antwerp. Also among the guests were Prince Joachim and his wife, Princess Marie, and their three younger children, Count Felix, Count Henrik, and Countess Athena, who had traveled from Washington DC for the event. And then, of course, Queen Anne-Marie of Greece was present and she was wearing her Khedive of Egypt tiara, her sapphire uh, diamond swan brooch, and Princess Benedicta was there too with her amethyst suite and the St. Wittgenstein Berlinburg fringe tiara. Uh, of course, uh, Crown Prince Paulus and Crown Princess Marie Chantal of Greece also attended the event. To commemorate this special occasion, the royal family shared a number of unseen photos of the prince's childhood. And another bit of curiosity is that the 15th of October has been declared an official flag day in Denmark now, so from now on, all state buildings and state ships in Denmark will fly the Danish flag on Prince Christian's birthday every year. And in addition to the gala dinner, Prince Christian's milestone birthday will again be marked on November 14 when he is going to attend a meeting of the Council of State and he will declare that he wishes to comply with the Danish constitution. Thanks for watching this video, we hope you liked it. If you did, please like and share and watch this space for more. Bye!